Atomic Structure by Daryl L. Walker. Matter is anything that has mass and takes up space, which is also known as volume. There are four states of matter, but there's three that will be discussed today. We have solids, liquids, and gases. Um, something that is solid could be like a cube of ice. Your liquids could be a puddle of water. Your gas could be like a puff of air. All matter is made up of atoms. We have our protons and neutrons, which are found here in the center of the atom, which is also known as the nucleus. On the outside of the nucleus, we have our electrons. Both the proton and neutron are found in the nucleus. Protons have a positive charge, which is notated by a plus sign here in the center of this illustration. Then we have our neutrons that have a neutral charge, which are denoted by a dot. Electrons are found outside the nucleus. We have a electron here and also here. These are denoted by negative signs because they have a negative charge. Lastly, we have our solids, liquids, and gases. I have a concept map here. With our solids, the atoms move very, very, very slow. The atoms are more compact together, therefore making a solid solid. We then have our liquids where the atoms move faster than the solids but slower than the gases. Here I have a puddle of water here. Notice here in the illustration the circles which represent atoms are much more spread apart than they are of the solids. And then we have our gases over here. Uh, the atoms move much faster than a solid and a liquid. Uh, here represents a puff of gas. Notice here that the circles, which again are atoms, are much more spread apart than they are here of our liquids. But our liquids here, the atoms being represented for the liquids, are obviously more spread apart than that of our solids. Your three states of matter. Thank you.